All right, not only is it Wednesday and it is Ron Smiley's birthday, mm -hmm. it is also no housework day. This is a holiday, apparently. Sign me up. So it is a day to put your feet up. You can just relax, spend time with your family. The vacuuming can wait. The dishes can sit in the, the sink. It doesn't matter. Can you do that? I can't do that. If there are dishes in the sink, I can't go to bed. It depends what kind of day I've had. There are days that I can do that. Most of the time it annoys me because I like, I like to not have something left undone. You know what yeah, I mean? Yeah, we but, call it the reset. Like we need a reset. Every morning when Frankie is home and right. Rocco's napping and the girls are at school, he does a clean of the first floor because that's like, that's where we spend the majority mm -hmm. of our time. Sure. We call it the reset. Yeah, well that makes yeah, sense. You gotta just wipe it all away. <laughs> Reset and then it's a mess. And, and then it'll later, become but, a mess yeah, later. <laughs> right. But that's that's not what's important mentally. Yeah. I, and I think we should talk to life coach Marlene Boaz about, about this that. at some point. Yeah. Because I think mentally it is a reset for you. Yeah. But anyway, so no housework day made us think about how much time do you end up, do we all end up spending on laundry and dishes and cleaning? So oh. that is what makes up uh, our, our list today. This is going to be yeah. very sad. So list. overall, the average from this poll done by uh, one poll uh, is that people said uh, they spend five hours and 54 minutes a week on housework. That's and one of the most time consuming tasks, this would be them. Okay, number one on sweeping and dusting. Did I ever tell you my least favorite chore? Oh, yes, cleaning the blinds. Dusting the oh, those <laughs> blinds. No. Oh. Now, do you have the fuzzy duster thing yes, that you can get you in between? Yes, you have to dust them and then you have to wipe them down. Like then you have to get, you know, soapy water and clean them. It's very, it takes yeah. a lot well, of time. Well, that's why it's 50% yeah. of your cleaning time it. goes to that. Cleaning the bathroom, 48%. Gross. Laundry is 44%. This adds up to more than 100%. <laughs> I am going to admit something here. I, we often live out of laundry baskets. Yeah, I, I have done that. I too, think that most where, people do. Like, it, sometimes socks don't make it in the sock drawer. And, like, I, I, oh. they, they at least get made it up. But, like, sometimes they're on top of the dresser yeah. before, no. you know. I'm talking full on, like, we had three laundry baskets in my room. Just, <laughs> just pick it out just of the Just earlier basket. this week. Yeah. You know what? I don't think there's any crime in that. No. And I think during the pandemic, like, one thing that made us clean up our house was when we would have people over. Yeah. Well, we haven't really had people over. Oh, so what's during the state of time. your residence right now? <laughs> Let me tell you. The high field. <laughs> yeah. I don't know when we've dusted under the piano last. <laughs> I, I, so I, fancy. I do, no, I do. I, I remember. <laughs> I don't know when we've justed under the piano last. Like that. I do remember <laughs> a, a while ago we had friends over and they were sitting on the couch and they said, "Oh, is the wood a different color under your piano?" And I said, no, it's just <laughs> hadn't dusted there. <laughs> Just lighter so, from the dust, the yeah, layer of dust. Put a special. You know, we're yeah. not celebrating today because we actually celebrated on a different day, but it's weird that National Beer Day and no, National No Housework Day fall on the same day. Yeah, I'm thinking great minds were thinking about that. I think there was something with Putting that. Putting the two of those yeah. things together. 